to our channel. So today we'll be reading another little golden book called From the Square Pants to Where the Pirates Are. One morning, business was usually slow at the Krusty Krab, so SpongeBob and Patrick decided to play a pirate board game. Hooray, Spongebob shouted. That's eight gold coins for me. They're mine, Mr. Krabs yelled as he came running out of his office. Wait, these are just plastic. He looked confused. Well, of course they are, Spongebob replied. They're part of, the, of this new game, the Flying Dutchman's Treasure Hunt. It's based on a real treasure map. Mr. Crab sat at the table and started to play. Mr. Krabs loved the game so much that he made SpongeBob and Patrick play for hours and hours and hours. It was close to midnight when SpongeBob left work. The next morning, SpongeBob heard Mr. Krabs' voice outside his window. Rise and shine, boys. Who wants to go on a real treasure hunt and be real pirates, Mr. Krabs said. When they looked outside, SpongeBob and Patrick shouldn't, couldn't believe their eyes. Mr. Krabs had built a pirate ship. Me, me, pick me! SpongeBob and Patrick yelled. They want to be pirates. We want to wear eye patches and, le and peg legs and funny hats. Most importantly, Mr. Crab said, you got to dig for treasure. We got to dig for treasure. Then, what are we waiting for? Let's go, exclaimed SpongeBob. The three pirates set sail. Can we see the map? Captain Crab, SpongeBob asked. Uh, no, Mr. Krabs replied. Only the captain can lay eyes on the map. Please, SpongeBob asked again. I said no, answered Mr. Krabs. While SpongeBob and Mr. Krabs were arguing, no one noticed that the ship was heading for land. Crash! The, sh the ship smashed into some rocks. We need to head east, Mr. Krabs said. Patrick checked his compass and the pirates walked and walked. They didn't find any treasure. Something was wrong. Oh, east, says Patrick. I thought you said west. Mr. Krabs took the compass and looked at it. That says West Patrick. Oops, replied Patrick. The three pirates really retraced. retraced their steps. It grew dark, so they decided to stop and set up camp for the night. I'm so excited to be a pirate, says Spongebob. I don't even mind that Mr. Krabs is sleeping in the nice warm tent while we're sleeping outside. What do you say we go get Mr. Krabs and keep looking for the treasure right now? Spongebob and Mr. Spongebob and Patrick jumped up excitedly and went into the tent. They called Mr. Krabs, but he was nowhere to be found. Then SpongeBob, 
spied something on the ground. It was the map. Let's take a quick peek, Patrick whispered to SpongeBob. When they looked at the treasure map, they were shocked. It was just a board game taped on a piece of paper. Suddenly, Mr. Krabs appeared. So you think Captain Krabs is crazy, eh? They growled. He growled. He growled. No, of course not. SpongeBob tried to re reassure. reassure him as he slowly backed out of the tent. Then he gasped. Gasped. Look, it's the X. SpongeBob and Patrick started digging. They quickly uncovered a treasure chest filled with gold coins. They began to celebrate, but all the noise woke the ghost of the Flying Dutchman who promptly arrived to claim his treasure. You found my treasure, and you saved me a whole bunch of gigging. The Flying Dutchman said to SpongeBob and Patrick, Here are two gold coins as an as a reward. reward. Hey, what about me? said Mr. Krabs. This is for you, said the Flying Dutchman, and he, and he handed Mr. Krabs a small object from the game, exclaimed Mr. Krabs. The Flying Dutchman replied, I, but it's based on a real treasure chest. Good story. Hope you guys enjoyed SpongeBob SquarePants, Where the Pirates Are. Stay tuned for more book reads coming soon. Take care. Be safe. Bye. Bye.